I previously made a video on Google Assistant and how you could get it on rooted devices but in this video I will show you guys how you can get it on non rooted devices and this also works for marshmallow devices so without wasting any time let's get straight into the video so first of all you will have to download the Google app file it is actually the latest update for the Google app I will leave a link to that in the description box below it is the official APK only and it is the latest one so after you have downloaded it, you can transfer it to your mobile. Now we'll need to change some things on our mobile. So first of all, go to your settings menu and make sure that your language is set to English United States. Even if it is set to some other version of English like English India or English UK, you'll have to change it to the United States one. After you have done that, you'll have to open the app section in the settings menu and then search for Google app. After you go in the app information, you'll have to tap on storage and manage space. Here you'll have to clear the app data. You'll have to do the same for Google Play services as well. After you have done that, you'll have to open any file manager app that is on your phone and you'll have to browse to the file that you have copied to your phone and then just install it. It will update your Google app to the latest one. After you install the app, click on done and now you also need to make sure that the Google Pay services is up to date. You will have to sign up for the beta program and if you get an option to update your application, you can do that. And after you have made sure that your language is set to English, you have cleared the data of both the Google Play services and the Google app and you've installed the new versions of the Google Play services and the new Google app. After you reboot your phone, you'll have the Google Assistant. So just before rebooting, I will show you guys that this mobile is running Marshmallow. So I'll go ahead and restart the device. So while the phone reboots, if you have not subscribed to the channel yet, you can go ahead and do that because I keep making content like this. So I just restarted the device and now you can see I'm having the Google Assistant. So that's it for the video guys. If you like the video, you can click on the thumbs up button and you can also watch some previous videos on this channel.